one? Yeah, thank you.
after all graduates receive their credentials. Okay. Carrying the college mace and leading the processional is our marshal, Captain Steve Carey. And carrying the college gonfalon is John Leverett, Lanier Technical College's 2023 Instructor of the Year. Now, please stand for the processional and remain standing for the national anthem. <laughs>
support group here. That's your family member and your loved ones. Thank you, family members, for your investment, support, encouragement of our graduates. Graduates, let your family know how much you appreciate them and what they've done for you. I'd also like to take a moment of reverence. This year we lost a fellow classmate of yours and one of our instructors. So if we could pause for just a moment of silence in their honor. Thank you. Now let's get to the reason we're here today. You are graduates. You built a foundation for a career that has unlimited potential. You have met and exceeded our academic challenges. Or, as your graduation mates, Gina Sullivan and Kayla Wright put it, you have persevered. You represent the best of Lanier Tech, and you have earned the right to sit here today. Each graduating class is very unique, and I want to share some of your uniqueness. Your graduating class is 1,196 strong. Your average program GPA, 3.48. You're a very bright class. Your ages range from 15 to 63. And very importantly, your class set the all-time enrollment record in the history of the college in the fall of 2022 at 5,598 students. You are a history making class. You all have your unique journey that led you to Lanier Tech. Maybe like Emma Etrus, you found your passion as a high school dual enrollment student. Undoubtedly, many of you are proud to be first generation college students like Richard Cuppinger, Brian Lopez, and Faith Walker. Like Jessica Castrosana or Rayanna Carter, many of you started college after beginning your family. And in addition to achieving your career goals, you want to be an inspiration for your own children. And perhaps some of you, like Shelly Ferraro, are receiving your second credential from Lanier Tech. No matter your pathway, today we celebrate and pay respect to you. I'm convinced we're each born with our own unique gifts and talents that define our purpose in life and that true fulfillment only comes when we use those gifts and talents in a meaningful way. The fact that you've invested your heart, your mind, and your body and to your chosen voca vocation convinces me you are on a pathway to career and life fulfillment. I'd like to close my remarks by reading a poem by math professor John L. Trulove, written to our college's class of 1980. To the students of Linear Tech, the road draws us forth, then runs ahead to far places and distant steads, through valleys and forests, lush and green, over hills, across rivers, under the sun's sheet. The way is both easy and rough, steep and level, soft and tough. So we climb the hills one at a time, explore new waters, now fresh, now brine. We've trekked together these last miles, I've seen your faces, smiled your smiles, and the joy it has been just knowing you, the things you are, the things you do. Now your road turns left or right, and you'll be gone ere the night. I want you to always keep this thought with you. The Near Tech loves you, and I do too. Congratulations again. Celebrate this milestone in your life and I wish you great success and prosperity. Thank you. <laughs>